Daniel, you are such a racist. No, I'm just kidding, man. Alright, so hello, the tube of you. I'm Robbie, your YouTube, and this video is a response to Daniel Salzbach, aka Mr. Repsion's uh, video entitled Daniel, you're Mr. Repsion, you're such a pussy, something like that. I'll have a link to the video down here. So in the video, Mr. Repsion's replying, reacting, what have you, responding to a video that was done by a woman named Cindy Can Be Original. She's a YouTuber who puts out a lot of videos that are full of utter tripe about religion and that's basically her entire platform is that she's this religious zealot who likes to basically just throw a bunch of really ultra conservative, ultra xenophobic, ultra homophobic, ultra discriminatory filth on the internet. She attacks Mr. Epson, Daniel, uh, for a video he did in which he talked about a pilot who was in a plane that was going down and instead of helping out you know, the, the people on the plane, instead of doing what he's supposed to do in an emergency crisis as the pilot of the plane, he instead just sat there and prayed. One thing, one, one story that comes to mind when I hear about this is the situation where, um, you know, there were these parents recently and their daughter died from not being taken to the hospital because they just sat and prayed because they didn't believe in hospitals or medicines, it was against the religion. So they just pray. Okay, that's great, but yeah, it's not really gonna help. No, I believe in a higher power, um, but I don't necessarily believe in organized religion. I'm somewhat of an agnostic, somewhere between Christianity, agnosticism, and Buddhism. Some little bits and pieces from kind of all three theories. I don't really have a set belief, and I don't really think anybody should because how can we? really 100% say that anything exists out there, but whatever, that's neither here nor there, that's a different video, um, all together. One thing that Miss Cindy said about Daniel was that he was singling out Christians. She actually said this about three or four times in the video. Daniel has almost 700 videos on his channel, he's I think at like 685 at this moment. Let's cut the guy some slack, if you actually go through his videos here, you will see that he hasn't only talked about Christians, he's talked about Mormonism, he's talked about Islamic, um, you know, Muslim religion. He's talked about, you know, all sorts of different religions, Jehovah's Witness, etc. And uh, he's not just talking about Christians. Now, he does talk about Christianity more often than anything else because, yeah, he was raised in a Christian household and he lives in a mostly Christian country. It's something he has the most knowledge and experience on. Why wouldn't he talk about something that he actually knows about? So, no, Cindy, he wasn't singling out Christianity. I do like, however, that he had to <laughs> repeat in his response, no, I'm not singling out Christianity and literally went through the whole list again. That was pretty funny. Another thing that the lovely Miss Cindy was uh, talking about was in another video of, of Daniel's where he talked about you know, female genital mutilation, and uh, basically saying that she made a uh, claim along the lines that no religion believes in genital mutilation. Okay, hi, uh, can we talk about circumcision for a minute? Yeah, there's plenty of religions that believe in circumcision, plenty of cultures as well. Do we really want to say that no religion believes in genital mutilation? Please, don't insult us. Those of us that have penises, please don't insult us because we already know that's bullshit. And I think it's quite ungodly of Miss Cindy to call Daniel a coward and an anti-Christian pussy when that's sort of being judgmental, which is sort of hypocritical and sort of something that God doesn't want you doing. He kind of says quite a few times not to judge unless you be judged yourself. He kind of says it's not your place. You're supposed to love your enemy as much as you love thy neighbor. Just throwing a few of these out here. 
Any of them ringing a bell? No? Oh, okay, yeah, that's because you're full of shit. <laughs> okay, great. Just make it sure we're on the same page. We're on the same page? On the same page? But in all seriousness, in all responsiveness to that plane, Daniel, if you do happen to watch this, which would be fucking rad, but yeah, if you are watching this, you anti-Christian pussy, dude, you know what they say. You are what you eat, right? But yeah, I mean, you know, if you want to check out her video, I'll put a link right- Oh, wait, no, I won't, because it got removed. Oh, gee, you know, that sucks. That, that really sucks. But yeah, guys, uh, that is all I have to say about that. Cindy, you're full of crap. Please, stop making videos until you kind of enlighten yourself to the world you're living in, because you're living mentally in, like, the 1950s, which is kind of ironic because it'd probably be a not-so-fun time period for you as well, but whatever. Um, you know, you hold on to that hatred that you harbor, darling. I really hope that hatred and that judgment and that really closed-minded way of thinking serves you well. Probably won't, but uh, here's hoping that works out for you. I'm gonna go ahead and continue being an open-minded individual, just like... Mr. Salzbach. So, I don't know. Maybe it'll work out for us. Maybe it'll work out for you. I don't know. You know maybe we can all like meet together in the afterlife and find out what happens. Um, or, you know, just all get reincarnated into like a fucking dog or something. Cool. Alright, well, other than that, free love. Peace out. Talk to you guys later.